Right, I'm going to do um, a makeup tutorial today um, using my Too Faced chocolate bar palette. Now I've not used this at all before but I have to be careful with it because that bit comes out, it's like glued off or whatever the glues come off of it. Um, so I just have to be careful with it, that's the white chocolate. I'm going to use it. I haven't used any of these shades before, um, but I also want to do tutorials of me using my Naked 1 palette and make Naked 2 palette, but I wanted to do this one first. So this is the Too Faced Chocolate Bar. I got This was my first palette out of them three. This was the first palette that I got, and then I got the Naked one. No, then I got the Naked 2, and then I got the Naked palette. Don't know why I got the Naked 2 palette before I got the Naked 1, but I haven't used any of them yet. But first off, I'm going to, obviously, I'm going to prime my face. I don't use primer all the time, but I want to try and use it a little bit more. So... I'm going to put some on my fingers and then put all over my face and all over my face. Try not to use too much. I'm quite spotty at the minute. Um, I've put spot stuff on it and face masks that help with spots and nothing seems to be they don't seem to be going away just yet. I normally get spots around my chin and that's where they are. I get spots on my chin or on my forehead and I don't have any spots on my forehead. I don't, oh, there's little bumps but they don't bother me. The ones on my chin bother me though. I'll put a little tiny bit more of the primer on my eyes. I'll have to try different hair looks and stuff, like tutorials on how to do hair or something. I don't know. I'm not really that well, um, like, in knowledge with hair stuff. And then the next thing I'm going to do is condi conditioner? What? Foundation. <sighs> Doesn't even sound the same. Um, I'm going to use my sponge that I always use with this. I don't know why I always use it, but anyway, I'm going to use it. It's not really coming out. I'll try and just put it in like that. I love it didn't come out there. I need to get my eyebrows plucked, or if not plucked, waxed. Waxed and plucked. And then I can pluck them myself. 
though I mentioned that to to the girl that does my eyes and she goes you shouldn't pluck them after coming whenever they need plucked you should just get them waxed again so maybe I should just do that I think that's all of my face covered with my foundation just put it on my neck a bit just doesn't seem to, that I put that much on try a little bit more on the nose This isn't really the same colour. It's not really a colour that fits. It's kind of like a diff, like a deep colour. This is the shade um, True Beige, I think. Yeah, True Beige. And the Revlon's colour stay. This is actually in my um, project pan and I have been using, I use, I've used quite a lot of it. Then I will do my bronzer. Or should I? Do you do bronzer or mitt? I'll do the bronzer first, and then I'll do the then I'll do the um, blusher. I don't always put the bronzer all all over my face. But it's like that. Um hmm. then I will do my my blusher. And it's like that. This is the cream blush. I don't know. I think I got this from a magazine. I got it with the, a couple of other blushes, cream blushes. Um, one of them was like a creamy colour that um, I put on my eyes. Um, like a primer kind of thing. Um, then I will do my eyes and I'm going to start off by using the, what's it called, champagne truffle, yeah that's right. Um, oh, I've got an itch under arm, sorry, there we go. Um, then I'm going to use my eyeshadow brush, it says contact direct on it if that means anything to you 
Um, I got it from whenever I was doing beauty therapy. So I'll do that over here. It's very like a creamy pinky color. Then I'm going to put on what is it? Strawberry bonbon, which is just a pinky shade. I'll do another wee one on this side. Then I'm going to put the last lay, I'm going to put the Black Forest Truffle, which looks kind of purpley and it's glittery, like pinky glitter. I'm not very good at doing my eyes. Oh, that's a bit out. I really wanted to do this one because um because it's got the glitter. But I don't know. Oh my god, that's a mess. Put a little tiny bit more on this side. And whoops, did that bit again. Okay, maybe I don't really like this. I don't know. I'm just messing up my makeup. And then I'll put a little bit more of the champagne truffle, but I'll put it up here 
like kind of like a highlight for my eyebrows. So I don't know if Should be alright. I don't. I don't want to mess up my makeup. <sighs> then I'm going to do my eyeliner. I'm just gonna put the. Eyeliner on my waterline. Well, this one on my waterline, and then I will put a liquid eyeliner on my upper lid. like so I'll put a little, another wee one on here about the same darkness um, then I'm going to do my Rimmel London Glam Eyes Professional Liquid Liner now this is my favourite liquid liner well so far I do have a new Urban Decay Naked um, 3 palette or not palette what am I talking about? Naked 3 um, eyeliner. But I haven't tried it yet. <laughs> oh, let me see. <laughs> Itchy nose. Right. I'm not the best at putting liquid eyeliner on. That one's a bit messed up actually. No. That's not fair. I think I might have to try that bit again, the flick bit. There, I might it a little bit. Oh no! Ah. 
No. My eyes are all war like watery. not too bad now I mean it still looks a bit of a mess but I'll just try this flick there that should do it for now that looks no, no. I can never get them the same. No, that's still quite bad. I give up. Oh, that doesn't look too bad now. Though this eye is really watery and I think that might be why. I don't know why. Oh, it's just gone off. Because it's really watery at the side there where that water light or where that flick was. Ah, right. I don't know why. Ow! It's not sore, it's just really annoying. <sighs> oh God. This is a disaster video. Right, I'll tr I'll, I will attempt the flick again. I will fix this side up first. Right, I will try and put some eyeliner on here again. There. That looks longer now. Oh well. No, I'm gonna do the. I'm gonna do the black forest truffle thing over again because because my eye shadow there is. As my eyes done. Well, apart from actually, no way, it's not. It's not finished. My eyes aren't done. I'm gonna put the NYC thickening mascara on. 
NYC studs for New York color. It's not very great. It feels like you need like water or something in it. I don't know. I don't know. Normally they have, normally they're more thicker. Maybe it's because this is cheap. Not, I don't think I'll get this again. This is the second time I've got it. But I don't think I'll get it again. <sighs> I think what I will have to do is use some more. I'll put it another. <sighs> it doesn't look like you've got any product on it, so I don't know what's. Oh well, I'll think I'll use water next time. Then I'm gonna do my lips, and what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna put on the Nivea Lip Care um, Pearl and Shine. And then I'm going to put the red, read my lips, um, angel lip gloss over it. This is a lip balm. And it's like a shiny pinky colour. But to make it even more shiny, I'm going to put the lip gloss over it. If that works. Let me put it there. Now you can still get the Read My Lips Angel Lip Gloss from Avon and it's in the colour trend um, part of it. Uh, so yeah, this is my look for today. Hope you like it. Hopefully I haven't just made a complete disaster of my eyes. Looks not too bad. I'm still not 100% great on doing makeup. Though I should be, but I'm not because I am coming 27. So what I'm going to do is put the setting spray I don't know how many sprays you're supposed to do. I don't know if you're supposed to do pat it dry or anything. It doesn't say. Oh, it says two to four times, but oh well. Uh, so yeah, that is my look for today. Um, I've also done an autumn look video, if you haven't seen it already, then go and check that out. I'm going to try and do more makeup videos, probably every single day. Um, well, depending on whether I want to film or not. But, you see, I don't have a set time to film or set videos to put up. 
I just do whatever I want to on a day-to-day -day basis and I hope you like it like that. If I do get busy, mind you, I will probably set up like uh, when to do my videos and stuff. So, but if that does happen, then I will let you know. So, this is about 30 minutes long, so I'm going to cut it short and now and say goodbye. Hope you have a nice day. Give me a thumbs up if you liked this video and comment down below. Send me messages if you want, um, if you want to be friends or anything because I'm welcome, I'm welcoming friends on the YouTube channels and stuff. So yeah, bye.